प्लीज क्लिक ऑन सब्सक्राइब बटन एंड क्लिक ऑन बेल आइकन फॉर मोर इंटरेस्टिंग अपडेट्स ऑन सिविल इंजीनियरिंग कॉन्सेप्ट इन दिस वीडियो आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू हाउ टू ड्रॉ द कॉलम्स फॉर द रिस्पेक्टेड फ्लोर प्लान बाय यूजिंग ऑटो कैट टू डी सॉफ्टवेयर सो आई वॉज ऑलरेडी एक्सप्लेन माई फ्लोर प्लान विच इज रिलेटेड टू डबल बेडरूम हॉल किचन पोर्शन इन ईस्ट फेसिंग डायरेक्शन सो फॉर दिस रेस्पेक्टेड बिल्डिंग प्लान आई विल ड्रॉ द कॉलम्स फॉर दिस रेस्पेक्टेड स्ट्रक्चर ओके सो इनिशियली वी नीड टू रोटेट दिस रेस्पेक्टेड मॉडल आफ्टर रोटेटिंग द मॉडल इनिशियली वी नीड टू डिलीट ऑल हैचेस so here i am deleting this hatch command for the entire building process so after deleting all this so initially we need to fix the dimensions of the column so for this respected g plus 1 structure it is sufficient to consider the 9 inches cross 12 inches column so initially we need to draw the polyline pl enter option so here i am selecting starting point so again we need to draw the 9 inches uh, line in horizontal direction so again in the vertical direction just we need to draw 1 feet line okay so in the horizontal direction just i am taking it as 9 inches again click on c enter close option so it will draw your respected rectangular section which is having the dimensions of 9 inches cross 1 feet so we need to assign this respected columns for this respected floor plan so initially we need to consider this respected uh, floor plan which is consisting of the dimensions of the height which is consisting of 30 feet cross 60 feet okay that 30 feet length will be exist in horizontal position and 60 feet length will be exist in vertical position so that's why we need to consider the higher dimensions of the column in vertical direction so that's why i am consider this respected column size in vertical direction is 1 feet okay so after drawing this respected options initially we need to assign this respected column for this building so for this building just i am assuming the columns will be consisting of 12 numbers so we need to adjust this 12 number of columns for this structure okay so initially we need to click on copy option co enter so select this respected object here so click on enter option so initially we need to select the corner for this right hand side section so just we need to assign this respected column to this respected point okay so after that we had to assign the another column for the another corner so here i am selecting copy option co enter select this respected column so here i am selecting this so select the corner point for this respected position again we have to assign this respected column like this okay so in the same process we need to assign the columns for the corners here copy so here i am selecting the column select the respected column here so here i am assigning this respected point like this so after that we have to assign the columns for the parking section also so here i am selecting line in vertical direction for knowing the intersection point again in the same way just i am drawing the horizontal line here so here i am selecting copy command co enter select this column so here i am selecting uh, corner point at this respected position so in the same way just i am adjusting this respected point to this corner okay so after that we have to delete all the lines which is in horizontal position so after that we have to continue with another column sections so for that initially i am drawing the line here reference line so select the first point so again i am selecting the f8 or the on option so here i am selecting the second point here so it will draw your vertical line here like this so after that just i am drawing one more line reference line for this respected section like this okay so tr double enter trim the excess of the portion now again we have to click on copy option so in this we need to select this respected uh, column again with the help of the polyline command which are drawn so select the corner point again we have to click on this respected point here like this okay so in the same process we can draw the lines here like this okay so here i am selecting a uh, copy command enter select this respected column select the corner point again we have to paste to this respected point here okay so now we have to draw the columns at this respected position also so here i am selecting the line l enter so here i am aligning the line in horizontal position f8 on option so again we have to draw the line in horizontal position for this respected section here so now i am selecting copy so select this respected polyline so click on enter option so select the base point here so select f8 option so here i am selecting first point here like this so copy here select this enter option corner point is like this so this is we need to select the corner again this is also one of the corner for this respected section again we have to copy select this respected line here select enter option select this respected corner okay now we have to draw the one more two columns for this respected alignment so here i am selecting line so select this point so click on f8 option okay so again we have to draw the one more line section which is aligned for this respected horizontal section like this so after that we have to copy this co enter select this uh, co enter 
select the object here first so click on enter option select this respected corner point so click on f8 option so again we have to adjust this respected corner to this point okay so in the same process we need to assign this respected corner point column for this respected section so copy select this respected point so select the point at this uh, at this so click on this point here okay so in the same process we need to assign the columns for the remaining sections here for the front facing direction so here i am selecting copy option cvo enter select this point select the base point here click on this respected point so after assigning all the columns we need to trim all the points inside this respected column position select these points like this so again we have to select this respected lines in horizontal position just trim it okay inside this respected points so again we have to trim the excess of the portion and we need to delete all the unnecessary lines in horizontal position as well as your vertical position for this plan okay so here i am selecting this respected line is unwanted section so here i am selecting uh, l enter just uh, prolong this line here so again we have to apply the trim tr double enter trim this so select this line so in the same process we need to select this respected line click on enter option so here i am selecting uh, top section so just we need to trim this tr double enter click on select this select this respected option okay so here i was drawn with 12 columns for this respected section now we have to delete the polyline rectangular section so for this respected assigned section basically we need to apply the hatching for the column section okay so for that we have to select h enter hatching command so here we have to select any one of the color otherwise you can select it as ar concrete basically we will assign with ar concrete itself so we need to select the color here so basically just i'm taking it as green color here so click on this respected inside point and we have to select the uh, scale here just i'm taking the scale which is related to 0.3 let us consider so here i'm selecting hatching for the column sections like this okay which is consisting of the concrete section inside this respected hatching property okay so here i'm selecting uh, this respected point again again i am selecting this point again i am selecting this point in the same process just i am hatching with this respected property so after that we have to apply the hatching for the remaining section for the building okay so for that just i am applying hatching h enter so here i am selecting 45 degree line for the walls sections so and see select the scale let us consider it as 10 click on enter option so here i am applying the hatching for this respected section so in the same process we need to apply the hatching so we need to change the color here to some white section let us consider just apply the hatching here now we have to delete this respected section okay so this is the process how to draw the columns for the 2d floor plan by using autocad software depends upon the architectural and depends upon the column position and depends upon the dimensions of the column the column layout will be changes okay so if you have any queries about this respected assigning the column please text me your questions in the below comment box i will try to give the answer for that respected question thank you